Hello, uh, this is Zoom Tips. Today I'm just going to quickly show you um, how to use your Samsung Note, whether it be your phone or your 10.1 tablet, as a sort of like a, a tablet device, uh, what a graphics tablet, that's the one. Okay, because obviously the Note uh, phone and the Note tablet both use um, Wacom as, as a sensitivity uh, towards a digit digitizer. Okay, today I'm going to show you both the PC setting up and the tablet setting up side of things. Okay, um, I found this brilliant piece of software. Okay, the link will be in the description. But all you need to do is you need to go to the website. Okay, here is this little website here. Uh, there's, there's nothing special about the website. But the main things are the downloads at the bottom here. Now I actually have the, the Dropbox, so I download it to my Dropbox. But you can download it to your PC as well, of which. Um, of which I suggest you just put it on your desktop. Now this you're going to need to extract. Okay, but for now I'm just going to open it so you can see what's inside. You will have an application, a .exe file. Now this, um, I say keep on your desktop. Okay, and just make sure you don't delete it because this isn't a shortcut. It's not an installed application. It just is a self-reliant program that just runs from this application here. Now this um, S Pen Digitizer .apk file is uh, the file you'll use to install on your tablet device. Okay, um, so that's why I installed my Dropbox, because on my tablet is my Dropbox, of which there I can install it rather than doing it via USB. So put this onto your desktop here. Okay, now run this file. Now it should boot up, and then this here, it will just stay at the bottom. Okay, you just need that minimize, it doesn't really matter. Now, APK file is where I'm going to jump over to my uh, phone. See, I'll let it sort out. So, your, your um, load tablet. This is basically just a, a bigger S Pen compared to my standard S Pen. But I'll use the normal S Pen just so you don't think it's something to do with that pen. Okay, so here's your standard S Pen. Um, so, what you're going to have to do here is go to your Dropbox. Okay, find your file, the dot a uh, the the um S Pen Digitizer dot APK folder file, which is this one here. Now you're not going to be able to install that until you allow installation of unknown apps. So you go to your settings, which I easily do through here. Um, to your settings. Now you're going to need to go to personal, and then security about here. Now you're going to need to go down to unknown sources which allows you to install apps from other places other than the Play Store. Okay, so you want to tick that feature. Yeah, okay. Go to your Dropbox. Now you're going to install your, your uh, digitizer the APK file. Once that's installed, okay, uh, it will come up here and then again you get your same icon. So what you've got to do is hit run of that file, open that app. Now it's just a blank screen, okay? Um, so now we go back to the PC, of which uh, I'll open just something like Paint. It can be any software, okay? Of which here, um, I'll, I'll do a crossover. I'll do an opaque vision of the tablet and the screen. So you can actually move your finger, okay? I'll just show you I'm not using my mouse before. And use your finger to move the mouse on the screen, but this doesn't actually draw anything on your screen. Okay, or you can hover your pen. Now this this actually moves the mouse still, and again doesn't create your doesn't create any drawing. But as soon as you press it, okay, so I'm gonna write hello. Okay, now that comes up on the screen. And then again I can draw like little smiley faces. Okay. Or I can, um, I'm not very good at art, so I'm just going to draw a little, little face. Okay. Just put a little face. Just going to have a little go here as well. Just going to have a just man body. Okay, well obviously it's extremely accurate. I mean, February is getting an update, okay, which makes it more reliable. Okay, um, I, I actually think it's brilliant. Just to show you, you can use it with any application. Open up uh, Photoshop. 
No. Okay, just to control new that. And again, like I said, I'll demonstrate this using the actual thing itself. So I'll go into what, the paintbrush, which is this one here, so paintbrush. Okay, now I don't really want red, so I'm going to go down to red. I'm going to go over to blue. Uh, about there. Okay. And then I'm going to look for something under, and I'll show the one out, um, draw the ocean, some waves. See? Okay, and that's it. That's pretty much it. We'll just set up. Okay, yeah. Um, I don't, it doesn't matter what edition of uh, your tablet uh, is on. Obviously, I've got the new Jelly Bean update now. Where, well, yeah, I'm from the UK. Okay. Um, thank you very much. Goodbye.